Uh, Rise of the Tomb Kings is available. Okay. Just gonna, just gonna get that, and now I'm just gonna go, uh, do some Warhammer. Uh, so, welcome back to a brand new, um, Warhammer episode, guys. Today we are going to be playing some, um, uh, Chaos, Chaos Let's Play. Um, so... First of all, let me just buy a Warhammer. Um, Rise of the Tomb Kings. Um, one second. <laughs> I did not know. Purchase for myself. Continue. I agree. Okay, so I just pre purchased uh, Rise of the Tomb Kings. <clears throat> All right, and now we are all good. So, welcome back to a brand new episode, guys. Today we are going to be playing some Chaos Warriors of Chaos or Chaos the Ever Chosen Warhammer episode. Um, so let's get straight into it. So last episode we were going, we were pushing forth on scaling, and this episode we are going to push probably around this pen uh is this a peninsula no it isn't um it's almost if this gets caught off but um ooh, aurora borealis it's pretty beautiful um people say that uh th these graphics aren't as good as warhammer one but they are completely incorrect because i love these graphics more than warhammer one and they're definitely way better than um, uh, Rome 2 and Attila. Attila didn't have good graphics. They, they rushed it out too much. Um, so let's just skip my guy and let's go. Construction complete. Palaquin of trophies. So last episode we got our... We got our dragon... Um, ogres didn't we yeah we got our dragon ogres so last episode we got our dragon ogres which i'm pretty happy about um i'm also pretty happy about uh Kieslev dying i'm also incredibly happy about um rise of the tomb kings because yet it's not out yet i think there's like a beta that you can go into after you pre-purchase it and yeah so that'll be pretty good. Okay, so technology research. Let's go s research some more technology. Uh, income from post battle. Okay, I'm just gonna do that. Uh, how hurt are we? Well, last episode we had our og dragon ogres fight, and they got incredibly hurt. Sorry, I'm getting a text. Um, I'm just gonna mute that. Uh, so. Your army is recruiting. Oh yeah, we're recruiting dragon, uh, I mean, uh, lances, aren't we? We actually built that last episode? Yeah, we did. Did we? Did we actually build that last episode? Oh my god, I did not remember that. Remember how I'm like, okay, we're just gonna do one more fight. One, one. Are you a god? No, I'm not a god, sadly. Um, I'm actually gonna take out... Steel Technology. Assault Garrison. Unassigned skill points. Still can't get any skill points. Um, let's just end the turn. So we are on turn, closing up on turn 80. I'm excited for that. The Empire is slowly coming back from the Dwarf uh, War. I'm pretty happy that um, the Dwarves almost took out Empire because Empire's... It can sometimes be a problem for Chaos. But other than that, we're doing fine. And um, new episode for... Um, with my cousin for High Elves. Hopefully coming out tomorrow, because we still have to record it. But, um, yeah. Oh, marble. Is that marble? 
If I was, um, scaling, I'd be happy for that, but I would not be happy to get murdered by RK on the Ever Chosen, because RK on the Ever Chosen is incredibly strong, and he will murder you. So, we got our Chaos Knights. All we need to do is get our Chaos... Upgrade this with three, and we will get our Chaos Knight Lances, which... They look pretty cool. Um, so, let's have fun with that. So, first, let's try to assault the garrison. Success. And I'll steal some more technology. Success. So, let's go. Into the fight. Let's see how easy this is going to be. Oh my goodness, we are going to auto-resolve that. Actually, look. let's look at the map. Let's look how easy this will be. Do you want to send in only my Chaos Knight? Let's do that. And, um... Our Shagoths. So, the reason why I haven't been uploading. Um, for the past three days, I've been working on a Dungeons & Dragons campaign. And just yet last night, I've been, I played with my friends. And I also haven't felt like recording and editing. So, most of my videos that will be coming out in the next week or so are not going to be edited, but once I get back into school, I'll have something to look forward to again, because I've been looking forward to doing, um, are my Chaos Knights already level 5? Okay then, um, how did that happen? What the heck? Okay, I guess that just happened. Uh, so Chaos Knights, they have swords, I think? So yeah, I'll have, um... Something to oh start deployment okay um group all of you together group and group you together group okay stay back here actually you're gonna have your back turned to them so we're gonna be really vulnerable aren't we and then we're just gonna ungroup you now we're gonna group you guys <coughs> excuse me <coughs> I want to look at these guys again these guys look amazing I want to look at them oh my goodness there's lines and lines of them okay so we're gonna actually split these two guys apart um, and we're just gonna send these guys in, we're just gonna send these guys in, and then they're just all gonna die because it's gonna be an easy fight. And just for safe measures, let's just send in some dragon ogres. Just some, just 12 dragon ogres, that's it. That looks cool. All right, let's go. Uh, these guys are about to flank. I can tell that because I, I just know what flanking looks like. Uh, but these guys are about to go after them, and let's just see the carnage. All oh, these poor dogs are just gonna get destroyed by dragon ogres. You want my, its eye? I don't think it has eyes. Those don't look like eyes to me. So, uh, guys, if you ever, if you ever want a, uh, D and D, uh, Dungeons and Dragons, um, like campaign thing, and they automatically flank, that's cool. Campaign on video, then just ask me, and I shall do that. Okay, so I don't really care about those guys at the moment, even though they have pole arms, which could be a bit frightening for us. So these guys instantly flank, which is a really good technique that I think, um... <coughs> I never played as Chaos in Warhammer 1. And I didn't have enough money for the DLC. But now I have enough money for the DLC. So... Um... All these guys are hidden back here? Okay. Uh, so these guys aren't fast, by the way. I wish they could be faster. What's their speed? 66? What's your speed? 90? <coughs> Excuse me. We have heavy armor.
You guys are doing nothing. Why don't you cut them off? Actually, go right here. <coughs> Excuse me. You know what? Why don't you guys come over here, too? Now let's trap them. Let's sandwich them. Sandwich them. Okay, and we caught some of them in the fight. Okay, so these guys are going to go around a flank. And watch, watch the brutality. Okay, you guys are like half naked. These guys are like giant centaurs, but they're not centaurs. So how do you pronounce it? Is it centaur or is it centaur? No, you're not. You're going to die. You guys retreating yet? You are retreating, but I don't know if we're fast enough yet. But we, we might want to get a couple more XP. Oh, no, you're rank 4, not rank 5. Sorry. Sorry. What rank are you? 3? Okay. Aren't you guys, like, rank 1? Yeah. I just recruited them. So, now that all of them are gone, let's just... Uh, Throw that right there just to see if it kills my troops. And the Arcoon. Does it hit any of my troops? Nope. Okay. And battle. Decisive victory. No kidding. We lost four. And know, you know who those four were? My lances. Oh my god, did I kill one of my, my uh, Chaos Knights? That's disgusting. Oh well. Um, easy fight. Um, loot and raise. Let's awaken the tribe. Ooh, we can get Prince Sigvald the Magnificent now. I am excited about that because now I can get all the legendary lords. So, let's do that. Um, let's do that in a second. First, I have to... So, who should I... No. Uh, should I get Kolak, Kolak or... Let's get Kolak. By the way, if they're right next to each other, they take um, attrition. So... I'm actually going to embed you. <clears throat> a manticore? Who's riding a manticore? You are? <clears throat> oh, guess you're going to join Kolek. So with Kolek, um, he does better with Dragon Ogres, so I'm gonna get some Dragon Ogres, Chaos, Confederation? Okay, the Empire Confederated on top of them, not the other way around. Oh crud, that would've been weird without the Empire in our game. So what we're gonna do is, um, we're gonna have Kolek go south, and, um... Archaeon go north, and then we're gonna eventually meet up, not too close because we take attrition, and then we are going to go the same ways, but like a bit out. Um, I was thinking we could go for possibly dwarves next, um, because we're gonna take out scaling within two episodes, so. Yeah, okay, so who's on the Manticore? You can go over here. And now, I, it's all over again. Like, we're starting all over again. We gotta, like, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna actually embed most of my people into that army. Uh, a couple of you, one of you, two of you. 
So now we're at negative 2,000. Uh, which is okay. Because we can just... <clears throat> we can just go into Force March down here. We can go into Encamp Stance and we shall get everything that we just lost. Uh, so what we lost was... Three of you. Uh, one of you. So, by the way, this is gonna be a negative effect on us. So, get ready for us to be in the negatives for a couple turns. Which is okay. Which is okay. Let's actually go with the two people last. Um... Chosen. One, two, three. And then one, one, two. So get per get ready for us to get destroyed with uh, money. We're not going to have much money for a while. So instead of instead of raising, we're gonna have to like loot and raise. So, I mean, it would be so we're gonna loot and raise with Archaeon. We're going to raise with uh, Kolek because Kolek we need plus ten really quickly. We need Kolek to level up so we don't have to pay as much for uh, characters. They took over Prague. Okay, we're gonna go take over Hell Pit most likely. How is Clan Mulder's strength going? Let me check. Um, Clan Mulder. Oh, they're pretty weak. Um, military access agreement broken. Bearsling. Oh, Bearsling's about to die. Which is Ostermark is out of the game. Actually, that's really good. Oh, witness me. Total favor minus ten thousand. No, I don't. I don't want that. Uh, diplomacy check. Beastmen encountered. Finally, that took a while. You're still recruiting, which is perfect. We're at negative 2,999. Perfect. Fireball, we can upgrade you. Nothing really to upgrade. Okay, perfect. Okay, so Beastmen will not attack us because they spread corruption too. And that's going to be good. So we're at negative 9,000 or 8,000 at the moment. They are going to take over Aisling, aren't they? If they take over Aisling, I'm going to kill the Beastmen. But if they don't take over Aisling, I'm going to let the Beastmen live. And don't worry, I can get out of bankruptcy really quickly uh, using Chaos. I've never actually had two armies before. I just went on with one army, and then I got Kolek after. Um, and then I got Kolek to level 7. Bearsling's out of the game. We'll just raise the dead. No, that's not Aisling, that's Sarl. Um, we still have one more. Guy to move right here, right? Failure. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Um, they took over Kislev? Why? What kind... What, what What? good would come out of that? Nothing. Exactly. You're an idiot. Okay, so I can't upgrade you anymore. So you're done. I can reset skill. No, I can't. Um, yeah. Alright, so let's go take over Kislev this round. Um, I mean, Kislev's almost out of the game, but I'm talking about this is Kislev, this is the Fort Kislev. They're gonna- that's scaling. We need to- we need to stop them. 
Scaling cannot go any farther, and if they do, we are dead, and if they don't, we- dead. Chaos isn't supposed to live that long. They're supposed to live like 200 rounds, and then they either win or lose. And I'm gonna- I'm looking to win. Okay. Okay. Um, it's gonna take a while to sail over to, um, the other maps, but I'm gonna most likely go after Croc- are next. So let's go take over Kieslev. Uh, we- Kieslev's out of the game. That's amazing. Uh, forged in blood. Okay, perfect. Decisive victory. And we're gonna loot and raise. Kolek is in the next level. No, we don't want you. Pollock, perfect. So what we need is serve or die. Where is it? Lightning strike will be good. Okay, so we're just gonna get rope marcher and then we're gonna get recruitment cost lower. And Horde growth. Okay, so Kolek's not going to be able to recruit for a while. I mean, there's no point in recruiting him in the first place. So are these guys attacking them? Or, like, what's going on? You're poisoned, aren't you? Yeah. Send forward you. Uh, how how much longer? Oh, you're done. Perfect. Uh, let's go. Down the way. Wait, will we take attrition? Oh, I thought we were about to take corruption. Okay, so you are the exalted hero. So let's just go with that. And let's end the turn. So, minus 3,000. Um, we'll get to minus 1,000 eventually, but... Uh, at the moment, we're gonna get minus 3,000. Yay! So, I looted and raises, raised because I, I wasn't actually attacking anything at the moment yet. So, yeah. Uh, with Archaeon. So, I don't want that to happen. So, we are getting really strong. We have two lord, two legendary lords. Um, so this is the only army that we can actually have two legendary lords on the same battlefield as at once. No, 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 it isn't. No, it isn't. I'm lying. I'm lying to you. Sorry. I was wrong. I'm lying to you. They took over Zoinshank again? Okay, I guess we're going back. <laughs> Nay! Alright, alright, so it's a full army battle versus a full army battle, but these guys are incredibly weak. These are Chaos Trolls. Um, I don't want to fight Chaos Trolls, but these guys are going to come after me, uh, but we can still take them. We're just going to have to deal with it. And if we don't, we're going to die. And I don't want Kolek to die because he has most of my army on him. Um, Ambusher discovered Morgor the Shadowgrave. Is he going to attack us? Probably not because we're friends. And we're friends with those guys. So hopefully they won't f attack Sarl either. And if they do attack Sarl, I'm going to kill them. Because they're only one army. We're only one army. The, the hard thing about this is we are only one army. If all of us die, the game is over. He still didn't reach us, thank god. Okay, uh, so let's just go check to see... Um... If we can- if we can take over this, that will be great. Auto-resolve, duh. Close victory? How's that a close victory if we only- 
That's 3,000. We're getting all of our... Actually, we're not doing anything, to be honest. Okay, so we can still move around? Heck yeah. Oh, wait, no, we can't. Did I just say heck yeah? Heck yeah, I did. Alright, so now let's go uh, murder these guys over here. Oh, well, they're already um, attacking them. Perfect. Now I have to move all the way back over here. Either this guy, assassinate 88%, or you, which is 43%. Oh, I know who I'm going to go for. So you have a manticore. You're the person with the manticore. I can't level you up anymore. Stop gaining levels. It goes up to hero level 30, by the way. Kolek, perfect. Um, we need you to get... Something. Um, we're gonna encamp next turn, or we are going to attack them. Attack scaling. Because they're north of, I mean, they're west of Kolek at the moment, so that'll be pretty good if we attack them. Beastmen, not attacking Zoinshank anymore. What are you doing? Oh, wait, no, they're going after the people that were at... Okay, so, trait gain. Taskmaster. Arcaeum the Everchosen. Uh, so, spent multiple turns in, in Marsh Stance. Campaign movement range, plus three. Campaign line of sight, plus three. Perfect. We're going to take over Bay of Blades, and then I might wrap up the episode. Actually, no, this will be a 45-minute long episode. Call to Arms. Entering War. I've been recording for 30 minutes. Oh, what, roughly 30 minutes. Why are you stealing technology? Okay, so Zoinshank, uh, they went back to Zoinshank. Hostile hero activity. Um... Let's try to assault the garrison, and then we'll just keep on going this way. Failure, that's okay. I don't care about you. Oh, horde upgrade. Oh, I can upgrade you. Oh, minus 10% upkeep. Perfect. These The scaling's gone. Oh, low funds. I'm going to demand money from people. Um, so if we want a non-aggression pact, I want... 3,500? 1,000? I'll just get a non-aggression pact with you then. What about a defensive alliance? What about a mud? No, okay. Alright, so that's enough. Okay. So now that I'm friends with Beastman, we're gonna go into the negatives. Which is just glamorous, because we are about to get minus 10% upkeep. And our army was like 3,000 upkeep. Well, yeah, it was more like 2,000. But, um... So that means we're gonna take out... Two hundred dollars. <laughs> That's a shame. Um, soon we're gonna get minus like thirty percent or maybe fifty percent upkeep. So that'll be good. Why are you trying to eat Colec? Like, oh god, I'm getting sick, aren't I? <laughs> that stinks. Okay. Yeah, Guhelter. Insufficient funds. Oh, yeah. We're bankrupt. Yay! Oh, 
Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely that auto resolve loot and raise, which we get so much money. Wait, we get seven thousand after attack money. Conditions that define themselves. Yeah, I know what attrition is. <laughs> RK on the ever chosen ruler of the warriors of chaos, and he's so evil. That he eats them raw. Well, he eats his enemies raw. Uh, but sadly, he died of constipation. Um, Guhelter, how are you, my man? My main man, that doesn't actually annoy me because you still have. Wait, 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 wait. we just. We're about to go on to turn 80. Oh, peace negotiated the dwarves onto the empire. Isn't what? Didn't the dwarves like want to kill the empire? Like, so they were. They had enough of killing the empire. Okay. So then they're like, let's kill them more. First, they're gonna peace. They're gonna get peace, but then. Arachnos? Why were there two Arachnoses, if you saw that? Rewind the video a bit. Um, the Arachnos was right here. It's like a, it's like a skull with a spider. Okay, so, ooh, they took over them, I think. Guhelter's wounded! Yay! It's not really yay. But I mean, like... Can't be sad about that. Thank you. Vinch me your soul. Let's go after these guys, because we're that cool. Actually, we need to... Are we encamped? Then why aren't we not getting like any chosen back troops replenish per turn six really five turns until they're all replenished yeah that's a joke right that's definitely a joke hopefully um it's high newt newt go check out green pigeon uh, no kidding. We can't. We kind of know that. No more attrition, cause we don't care. Goo gold gas hell knocks. He's evil and he um bites on people with his manticore. I have, I actually haven't used a Manticore in battle yet. I'm gonna I'm gonna use him in battle uh, on Carrick Ungor. Um, I mean they look really weak, so let's go take them out. So the Cult of Pleasure is like they they use mostly heroes, don't they? They use mostly heroes. Hopefully they do, because... Yeah, I remember. They use mostly heroes. They use, like, five heroes in their army. And then they use, like... Like, a couple normal people. Okay, let's go take over Carrick Ungor now. These guys aren't... Don't, I don't know what they're doing. Attack! Let's actually break the siege and get him to embed first. What is thy will? I actually don't know what thy will is. Uh, it's definitely a will for something, though. Uh, probably a will to kill people? I don't know. Alright, let's go take over Sarl and Kamen, because I... Let's turn on lightning strike. 
And armor piece piercing damage. Ooh. Okay, let's fight. Fight, 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 fight. Scaling, 840 allies. What the heck are these chariots? Why do they have so many chari six chariots? Uh, start deployment. That's a lot of stuff. Alright, so first let's just throw these guys back here just so I can get ready and I can see stuff. Okay, so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to throw in all my uh, infantry right here. So we're going to lock you, and then we're going to throw you guys in back. going to lock you. We're going to throw these guys to the side. Lock you guys. And we're going to go throw you guys right here, and we're going to lock your promotion. And then, since you are you and you're not uh, okay you are you're just gonna be right here okay so our can is about six feet tall that's how big they are oh uh, it's like 13 feet tall okay all right let's go jesus that's a lot of people let's just go right after them then Actually, I'm not countering that. So that'll do a couple damage. Just a bit of damage to, uh, herded them. Then we're gonna do that. Then we're gonna go throw you guys around here. Come on. Where's their lord? He's right here. Go after him. Alright, so you're going to get these guys. They're already retreating? That's sad. Wipe them out! Oh my goodness, that does a lot of damage. It does a lot of damage. It'll like kill them and it does a lot of damage. Um. Holy shoot. Take out those chariots! What are you doing, guys? So, this was a pretty easy battle. Um. Like, our Kaon's just destroying peeps. Let's see if we can catch him off guard. The Arcane. We get it, Arcaon. Okay, they're clearing away. Why does he like to say Arcane a lot? Okay, so we're just gonna try to kill as many as we can before they retreat because they do they can come back and kill us and we don't want that to happen so we're not gonna let that happen um yeah how am i a mortal fool actually let's take out the lord first Kill the Lord and then he's dead. Kill the Lord and then he's finally dead. Okay, is he dead yet? 
Are you dead? Are you almost dead? Are you dead? Okay, they just did. There he's dead. Finally, that took forever to kill him. Um, also, I've been playing a lot of Gang Beasts with my friends. That's why I haven't been uploading. Gang Beast is a really fun game. Uh, it's real, also really funny. Let's get the ones that aren't retreating. Why are we getting people that are retreating? What are you doing, chariot? You're just a single chariot just knocking people out of the ring. What is this chariot doing? It's like going backwards. Hor can horses even trot backwards? Can they? Fire. Are you gonna shoot your fireball? No? Okay, that's, that's okay. That's okay, that's okay. Um, I'm just gonna speed up the battle to four times and watch this f battle unfold. Yeah, let's see how this battle unfolds because it's uh, getting pretty boring, this, this fight. Okay, so now that these guys are retreating, um, and these guys are all grouped together, we're just going to try and kill people. A unit has been wiped out. Oh no, a unit has been wiped out. What unit has been generally Um, so they only deployed their 63, and they're both Thorhall, Southbane, and Abel. Okay, so they died, which is good. I think all of them did, since it was a, uh... Oh, we got a chosen unit wiped out. Let's get those chosen people back. Let's get the money, too, because we need some money. Tyrion's Eye. Is it Syrians or is it Tyrion's? Okay, so you guys cost 3000 what? What? <sighs> Excuse me. But boy. You have to be kidding me. What the heck? That's like a whole lot of stuff. Apparently I encountered Bretonia too, because they're apparently on my map now. And, um, yeah. So I guess that's how that happens. Um, Aisling's Conclave. Let's go raise up Aisling next turn. Because I'm going to auto-resolve it and we'll probably lose another unit, but... It's just to raise Aisling again, because Aisling can probably take out scaling by now. So we we're gonna do that. Oh my goodness. You have to be ki okay. You have to be kidding me. Okay, so it looks like I'm gonna recruit again. Oh. Well, of course, I'm gonna supposed to bring corruption. So. Post battle loot plus twenty percent. Post battle loot plus twenty percent. Post battle loot plus twenty percent in the blah 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 blah. We have a manticore, don't we? Yeah. Alright, so we're gonna fight this battle because why not? Why not? So it says my Intel lot my not, not my Intel, my Logitech um camera's on even though I'm not showing my face at the moment. So that's weird. 
it usually only turns on when I'm recording, so... <laughs> I did previously use my face when I was buying Tomb Kings, though, so that makes sense. I can't wait for Tomb Kings. It's gonna be so fun. Ooh, start deployment. So, we're going to deploy right here, because we're going to kill them. Because I want... Why is it so dark in here? But Squidward. Okay, so I need to group that all again. And what are you riding? You're riding a horse? The Manticore is a lot smaller than it is in battle. Okay, so let's just get ready to attack. By the way, we have like no people left. We're probably gonna die, but that's fine. Actually, let's do that. They're dead. Okay, nice job. Perfect, and then you guys are going to attack that wall too. Yeah, so this Manticore takes damage, damage quickly. But that's gonna be fine because we're beating the crap. Not able to be on walls? No, no matter. We're just gonna knock him around. He doesn't even care. Please tell me that gate's taking a lot of damage. Yeah, it is. Chaos Sorcerer. That does very, very damage, damage. Why would they run into it? Go kill them! Yeah, watch this, watch this, ready? Knocks down, first of all. And then just look at everyone to pile in. This was an easy, easy battle. It said it was going to be harder than it actually is. So we're actually going to go take over the objective. Because they stacked up on this wall for some reason. Our ledgers have docked on the walls. Increased the power reserves. Cool. So these guys are just beating the crap out of this guy, sadly. And you are beating the crap out of these guys. So let's uh let's just keep on getting you stronger. Uh let's let's attack you. You know what, just, just attack that. Just attack that. Uh, you are gonna go flank them. Uh, you are just gonna fly out here and shoot their pistol ears. Okay, so ready? Shoot their pistol ears. That's not their pistol ears, but nonetheless, it's, a, it's, it's, it's still a hit. Okay, so watch this manticore just, just fall on top of that. That's a lot of blood. By the way, if you don't like blood, don't watch this video. Because I do like a lot of up-close shots. These- look how short they are. 
Huh. So, like I was saying, I've been um, doing a Dungeons and Dragons campaign uh, for my friends, and we just played yesterday because I love fantasy, as you can see. Let's just go take over the objective. Don't tell me he's going through there. Okay, he's going through there. Yeah, of course, he's going the smart way. Yeah, you enjoy that. Eat the crap out of them. He's the, he's the sorcerer, so he's supposed to know every single spell. These... Okay, can you... Like, flank around them at least. Be smart about it. Come on. And another Rimworld episode. Probably coming out Wednesday. Now kill them. So we're taking over the objective. Oh, the enemy gates are destroyed. Finally. And let's go right here. Because we're just going to wait for these guys to kill all of them. Oh, my manticore's dying. Did you say, like, Mercedes-Benz? It's turning in, uh, into our command, right? It's slowly moving, right? Hopefully. Um, you actually can't get up there, so... Just run up there. Just run past that, like, two more people. Um... I feel like I do that too much. I, I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna fly away. Nope, nope, get out of the way. Nope, get out. Just run. And and the battle. And the battle. And the battle. Nope, I'm not dying to that. So we did it. We took over that and most of my guys are dead. <sighs> Except for most of them. Most of them aren't dead, but most of them are dead. But yeah, I don't know. So officially, Caricadrinas are almost over, I think. Hopefully. Was that Caricadrine? Was that a battle for Caricadrine? We gained 2,000 loot. Loot and raise is 15,000, but we're just gonna raise. No, that was Caric Ungor, because that used to be a faction, I believe. I believe that was a faction. There's Caricadrine. They are kind of scary. Okay, fine, 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 fine. I'll give you like. Okay, so Cola, you want lightning? I'll give you lightning. There you go. There's lightning. Serve or die? Jeez, that's. It's not something you tell. Your people, okay? I mean, it's not. Like, it's, it's just. Don't tell your people that, or else they'll hate you. So. Oh! Chaos Knights! Finally! They're done, I think. Uh, let's go take over Acelink's Conclave next. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was all in the same turn. You're kidding me, right? Okay, that was all in the same turn. Um, and I believe that is almost over, and I will leave it off there, most likely, hopefully, probably so, maybe, no, 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 maybe, like, maybe? Because it's been on for, like, an hour, I don't know, maybe? Um, Glen Pestilence? Um, Glen Pestilence, that was, like, a terrible accent for, uh... 
for scroll. So they're coming. So for Tomb Kings, they're coming out with four new legendary lords for Tomb Kings. So that's the that's the most um legendary lords in the whole entire thing. Scaling versus beastmen, perfect, perfection. Okay, we're just gonna. Yeah. Okay. Why do I have this? <laughs> I don't want this. No. Okay. Um. Oh my goodness. Um. Um. That's fine. I don't really care about them. I'm just gonna raise a sling up. And then we'll be okay. Auto resolve. <laughs> yeah, we lost another um thing. Awaken the tribe. Yay. We lost a unit. Yeah, we did. Uh so let's just encamp. Recruit some more. And I will see you. Where are they? In the next video. Bye bye everyone.